A little closer to home, the Virginia State Capitol is closed off today following the pro-Trump riot at the U.S. Capitol building. Leaders increased security in Richmond to prepare for any potential threats. Investigative reporter Evan Watson is there now for us. And Evan, what exactly does it look like? There are boarded up windows, added fences and security teams, but no protesters and no threat. And with a virtual session, that means it's very quiet today. Everything seemed to be just fine. Capitol Square closed until further notice. Access to the hill under lock and key. Even nearby buildings prepared for the worst. Yeah, uh, admittedly surprised. Um, I, I uh, would be lying if I said that I wasn't expecting any kind of craziness to happen today. But empty streets and sidewalks surround Virginia's top government buildings on an inauguration day in which security officials and state leaders feared for the worst. I, I, I think, really think, by not having a lot of activity today, it's just beautiful, man. That's all I got to say. You know, I love to have peace. You know, that's that's what it's all about. People in Richmond say they're relieved. They describe the last two weeks as stressful. It's pretty shocking. You know, I uh, I haven't been living here all that long, but I live right next to the Capitol, actually. So um, it's been uh, it's been pretty intense. Security guards and police officers walked around the Capitol Square today, confirming that everything was quiet. Despite the warnings, all is calm. Maybe it's just that people have kind of uh, expressed themselves and are, are kind of mellowed out at this point and kind of accepting the change and um, going to make the best of it as, as I think we all have to do. Evan Watson reporting for 13 News Now.